Yes, thank you. Residents in Walnut Hills are speaking out after they say slurs and profanities were keyed into several cars in their neighborhood. Simone Jameson spoke with one of those residents this evening and is live with the details. Yeah, Trisha Robb, I'm on Altoona Street in Walnut Hills, where some residents tell me they are still on edge after they found curse words and hateful messages keyed onto their cars. They say it happened last spring, but they want to bring attention to it now after seeing a Fox 19 report this week that residents in Norwood are having the same issue. Just wish they would stop, please. That's all I'm asking, please. This Walnut Hills resident who wanted to remain anonymous says she's been waiting nearly a year for Cincinnati police to catch the people responsible for keying curse words and hateful messages onto her work car and at least four others on Altoona Street. One said F-U-C-K, your God. The other one, Jehovah, hate lanes. She says it happened in March of 2023. The messages also included God hates you, expletive, F you, expletive, and what appears to say Adonai curses you. Adonai is the Hebrew word for God. I thought it was the children around here doing it because I had a Bible in my dashboard. The woman says one of her neighbors had to pay $6,500 to repaint his car and get rid of the message. She says other neighbors have been forced to find other places to park and cover their cars with tarp to hide the messages. For people to go around and destroy other people's property and not feel it theirself, you know, that, that truly hurts because it costs people a lot of money. You don't know how many people's lives you're destroying. The woman says she and her neighbors promptly reported their issue to Cincinnati police last spring. She says after seeing a Fox 19 Now report that vandals keyed similar messages on cars in Norwood this week, she wanted to speak up. When I seen the news the other night, I said, oh, wow. I said, their handwriting looks the same. I just pray they catch them. The woman says these messages keyed on the cars have a deeper impact than many people realize, something she doesn't want anyone else to encounter. People read that, you know, and then they, they look at you in a different way because they think it was something targeted towards you. Whoever it is need to be stopped. Now, I did ask CPD if they felt there was any connection between the cars he keyed here in Walnut Hills and those keyed in Norwood. They say since it's about a year apart, it's hard to tell, but that there's always a possibility. Cincinnati police continue to investigate the incident here in Walnut Hills. Anyone with information is asked to contact them. Live in Walnut Hills, Simone Jameson, Fox 19 Now. Simone, thank you. Take a uh...